Hi everyone, welcome back to Cakes and Color. Today I'll be showing you how to make a comics buildings cake. I started out by printing the comic strip I wanted to create on sugar paper and I'll be creating a building for each one of the squares in the strip. For the base of each building I cut up a cap of board in the exact size of each square in the strip and numbered them so I don't get them confused later on. I also wrapped each baseboard in protective wallpaper so the cake does not touch the cap of board directly. To plan the heights of the different buildings, I used wooden dowels, and later on I'll also be using them to support the cakes. For each building, I cut out the template in the size of the square, and then cut the cakes in the exact right size using the template. Next, I stacked up the cut up cakes on the building base, and put the dowel back in for support. I did this for all the squares in the strip. Next, I covered all of the buildings in ganache. A crumb coat, and then a regular coat on top of it. And this is what it looks like in the end, after all the buildings are covered, they're all different heights, and this is the view from the top. To cover the buildings, I used black fondant, which I rolled out, and then let it sit in the fridge for a little while. This way it's, it hardens, and it's easier to cut through in a straight line. I covered all sides of the building, making sure to cover the front side last, so that there are no lines visible from the fondant on the other sides. For some of the buildings, I wanted to create a blue sky sky background so I could create a building skyline in front. And for those, I covered the front side of the building in blue instead of black, and later on I'll attach the building skyline in front of the blue fondant. So as you just saw there, I rolled out the blue fondant for the sky behind the buildings and put that in the fridge as well, and then covered the front of the buildings I wanted the skyline for in blue. The rest of the building is just the same, black on all sides and the top. So this is what they look like all covered up. Uh, some are completely black and some have a blue front. So the blue shade of the fondant wasn't dark enough for me, so I used indigo luster dust to give it a deeper night sky appearance. And I know it's a bit hard to see, but if you look closely, you can see the difference in shade between the top and the bottom of the blue fronts. On to a really fun part, the windows. You can really play around with this, use different shapes, and maybe leave some of the lights off. Lastly, cut up a skyline out of black rolled out fondant, the width of the building, and attach it with some water. Unfortunately, I don't have this part video, but you can see the final result here. For the final touch, cut the comic square and the edible paper and attach them to the tops of the buildings with some water. So, this is the final result, a comic strip building cake. Thanks for watching my video. If you liked it, please share and subscribe. See you next time!